Hey there, what's up? I did review the, the footage from uh, last night. The wind, well, maybe not yesterday, but two days ago. Because I still haven't uploaded the, uh, the one that I filmed yesterday. I'm going to do it uh, as soon as I get back home, which will be in just a few minutes. But as you can see, there are three raids going on right now. One is for a terror and a terror, which I'm definitely not going to even try to attempt. And the other one, the other ones, I should say, are for two Zekrums. Also, two raids I am definitely not even going to try. I think I should just wait until uh, both of these uh, reach their end, so that I can uh, see if I can put my Pokemon in those gyms right now. A lot has happened tonight. First of all, let me just show you some stuff. I got a Lunatone, as you can see. This is actually my third or fourth Lunatone. Yeah, definitely the third because of nine candies. But yeah, I got my first ever Lunatone three times over, actually. It's always been hard for me because Lunatone is a very regional Pokemon, and uh, I apparently don't really live in the particular region where these things are abundant and this one is just trash but yeah at least that at least now I have Unotone in the Pokedex I suppose that's one thing that's one less Pokemon I need to catch now I don't really plan on using one of these uh, too much because I don't really have much of a need for a rock psychic Pokemon at the moment also this hmm, a dog I have the Magby look at him so cute I like this Magby it's not the best in terms of IV but it's pretty cool and um, again it's a Pokemon I didn't have before so that's something I suppose another less Pokemon to collect in the uh, in the Pokédex. So these are not, aren't bad, just, you know, not really the best. Maybe I'll decide to keep it and evolve it all the way to a Magmortar, maybe not, we'll see. As far as anything else, as you can see I caught a lot of Pokémon. You can't really see right now, but I uh, upgraded my uh, Pokémon box capacity to 600. That's something I just like I needed to do and what else oh by the way I did win another raid while at work which is something I said I was going to do in the previous recording and obviously I fulfilled that promise as you can see this Lunaton is a lot better than the other one as far as CP it's also better in, I in terms of IVs but not really all that much this Lunaton however it's got really good CP, it's almost at maximum, but its IVs also aren't something to write home about. So, again, I don't even know if I'm going to use these Lunatones at all. I'm definitely going to keep this one because it's easily the best of the three that I just caught. But I'm, I already have plenty of Soul Rocks, so I don't really need a Lunatone right now. Let me see if there was anything else. I wanted to mention probably not also anything exciting other than the Lunatone, the Magby and uh, the raid that I've won it was against the Clink and you guys all know how easy those are for me and I just I basically uh, took it out with with one Pokemon that being Mammal Swine so yeah nothing too exciting here but the most important part is that I've now uh, successfully battled 15 raids, which means I can move on to the next part of uh, this challenge thing. So, obviously there are two of these, so I'm gonna uh, get through one of these first, because the first, the second one has a, a random encounter. So, let's see what, the, what uh, the good professor has to say, now that I've 
successfully battled and won 15 raids. Hmm. And the game just froze on me again, as it usually likes to do. I'm not even sure if I, if I should... Yes, yes, network error. It's the usual excuse with you, isn't it? I'll be back in just a second. Okay, I restarted the game. Hopefully, it's gonna play nice. Oh, what's that? What's that? Yeah, not very interesting. So as I was saying, hopefully it'll play nice this time around. Spin these. And this one. Now let's move on to this part. And if it doesn't work this time around, I'm just gonna do it off camera. Here we go. Oh, thank you. Okay, that's one. Okay, so far so good, so far so good. Darumaka candy. Okay, just in case I need any. I can't stop thinking about how cute Oshawott is. It is cute, isn't it? As long as it's not Ash's Oshawott. Oshawott is a great Pokemon. Unless it's Ash's Oshawott, because Ash's Oshawott sucks. You're... Oh, you're back! Ex Excellent work catching that Darumaka. Did I catch a Darumaka? I can't even remember. Now that we've researched the water type, the fir first partner Pokemon of many trainers from Unova, let's shift focus to the fire type. Tip one, Tepig. Tepig is adorable. Pig Knight is... A big Y, if you ask me. Embor is just nope. So yeah, Tepig, I love Tepig, Pig Knight, and uh, Embor, get them out of the game. Stupid bus, go away. Go, go. Thank you. Okay, let's see. I am a particular fan of Tepig because it uses the fire, the fireballs that come from its nose to roast berries. That's a bit of information I didn't think I needed. Such a clever use of skill. Okay. I just love roasted pinup berries. We should continue our work and see what else we can discover. So I'm guessing it's going to tell us to catch a bunch of tepigs by using pinup berries on them. Uh, let's see, let's see. Make an excellent throw. Not that hard. Battle another trainer 15 times. I can easily do that with the PvP. Power up a Pokemon 15 times. Okay, so I guess I don't need to use pin-up berries. Power up a Pokemon, I can do that easily. Uh, make an excellent throw. I mean, with so many Solrocks and Sudaburos appearing so frequently during this event, I can pretty much do that without even trying. And battle another trainer. That's something I'm gonna probably have to do off-camera because uh, you know how uh, hard um, it is for this game to work when I'm recording, so let's just do the second one. Oh, so I'm guessing this is where we're gonna catch that Darumaka. Maybe, maybe I should have started with this one, the regular one. Let's see. Yeah, it's a Darumaka! Catch you! That was easy. Let's see if it's any good, because I already have a good Dora marker that I want to evolve into a Darmana 10. And now I can do that with all these candies. It's actually pretty good, not gonna lie. But I'll just have to compare it with the other one that I have. Obviously, he's gonna say the exact same thing that he just, uh, he just said to us. So let's just skip this. And yeah, pretty much the exact same thing. Make an excellent throw, battle another trainer 15 times, and power up a Pokemon 15 times. Easy, 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 schmeezy. So, uh, yeah. 
I'm pretty sure I'm at, I'm at three hearts berries with the, nope I guess I can do that later because we know we all know how hard it is for this for this uh, phone to show my buddy Pokemon while I'm recording it so let's just battle this one and walk up to those gyms and call it a day so it's a fire type specialist why Magnezone and, and Metagross like why seriously dude why when we have a Vaporeon and a Milotic seriously dude, why what's wrong with you why okay just wanted to check that uh, my Lodic was at full health. So yeah, this is going to be a cakewalk. Growlithe. Not that intimidating at all. Because it doesn't have Intimidate in this game. Wow, that's... I mean, we're crushing it. We're at half health, but I mean, it doesn't really matter. Houndoom might be a little trickier. It attacks a little faster. I couldn't pull off Hydro Pump in time. I'm tempted not to use Shiny Milotic because I'm pretty sure its fast attack is uh, Dragon Tail, which isn't very effective on Fire types last time I checked. I mean, it's not, you know, like they resist Dragon type moves, but I mean, it's not super effective like some Water type moves that, like, that I'm using with um, Vaporeon. Oh, it's like we didn't even have to worry about that. Pretty good, pretty good. We're doing all right. Go away. Go away and leave me a Pokemon to save. Ish. I don't care. I'm gonna be a real douche when I'm after a night shift. We gotta work on that. Mikachu. Oh, I thought I saw something. Well, that was easy. Let's check if I have enough candy to power up. Hmm, I have enough to power up my uh, other Arcanine, the, the fire type one, the, the fire type special one. Blah, 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 spin, spin, spin. Apparently, my Lodic liked the fact that we just battled, even though it wasn't even in the battle. So I got another heart from it. Ugh, sit up. I needed to straighten up. Because this bench is really uncomfortable for my back. Okay, now let's see. I love the fact that the character is still walking even though I'm sitting at the same place. Because it really helps out with uh, hatching eggs and stuff. And uh, finding candy with uh, my, uh, my body Pokemon and it also helps uh, with its uh, heart things, the friendship stats, whatever it's called. This tree is just raining flowers over me. Which on the normal circumstances I'd be okay with, but not while I'm on camera. I hate the fact that Sneasel's always come in ridiculously high CP levels. That's me this means uh, that it's not a wise idea to uh, to keep using pinup berries to, when, when trying to catch them. Spin you up, pull spinner spinner, and let's check it out. Just in case you were wondering, I'm almost at th uh, three hearts with my Lodex, so maybe, just maybe, and uh, battling with with it definitely helps. So maybe uh, we we can actually get to ultra body status while on camera but I doubt it, so let's just move on. Mm. 
I'm going to the gym, but not to work out. <laughs> Quiet today. I guess it's. I guess I can. I should, I should consider that a good thing because of how uh, badly it treated us the last couple of days. Although, again, I'm pretty sure I just jinxed it. Who knows? I'll never know until I uh, review the footage from today. I'm trying to click on this pokey stop, but I don't understand. Oh, guess we're still too far away. No big deal. There's a growl over here. By the way, I can power up my uh, fire spe spire special. I specialized the uh, Arcanine, and that'll be. I think it'll be enough for the power up one Pokemon 15 times. Well, technically, it's not. I need to have power up just one Pokemon 15 times. Just to power up Pokemon in general 15 times but I guess I can do that with, with uh, Arcanine I'm gonna have enough Stardust for that <laughs> unless of course I can't even remember if I've already done it now, last night would you stop that as you can see I've got the hiccups and it's really annoying Trying to trying to take breaks from between speaking, because, and just as soon as I acknowledged it, they're gone. Weird. Anyway, another Lunatone. Not that I care much. Like I said, I'm not only planning on using this Pokemon a lot. Find a nice place to sit and spin a few gems. But, dude, okay. now we're in a sitting position, and uh, I'll try to be quick about it because I really need to go to the bathroom. Let's at least try to be quick about it. Okay, I'm definitely not going to spend that Zekrom one just yet. Okay, here's a Soul Rock. I'm going to battle it, send it straight back to its trainer. And put one of my Pokemon in here. Well, I, I guess uh, Metagross is not a bad choice to start with, since it knows uh, Bullet Punch, which is super effective on a rock type like uh, Lunatone. And it also knows Earthquake, just in case we even get to that point. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're gonna uh, at least get to one Earthquake. Again, another move that's super effective on rock types. Okay, that's one. Apparently we're going to have to beat it two more times. I don't really care. I'll battle it whenever. However many times I'll need to. And I can still use Metagross. I don't even know which move it, did it use. But I'm pretty sure it was a rock type move since it didn't really do much damage. To my steel type Metagross. Barely any damage as you can see. Hmm. Yeah, I think I can beat, the, beat it this time without using Earthquake. Third time is going to be a, a walk in the park. Or rather a sit in the park. Because I'm sitting in the park. Didn't I already use this joke once? I'm losing track. 
Yeah, and I, I'm still using Meadow Bros. Hmm. Pretty much took it out with three hits. So three and a little tiny bit more. Which I guess still counts as four, but it's three in my book. Okay, let's put one of our esteemed comrade. Oh, come on. <sighs> Oh, well, no wonder. It decided to run all the way over there. Thank, thank you, sir. Okay, maybe not so much thank you. Just a little bit more. You know what? I ain't got time for this. Ain't nobody got time for that. I'm gonna spin this gym. And uh, spin all, I'm gonna spin, just spin all the other gyms for the. I did not click on you. Go away, please. I'm gonna spin all the other gyms just for the items. Still can't put anyone in here. This one's place is still full. Still no berries. You know, you gotta have those, gotta have them berries. Again, I didn't click on you. Go away. Go. L leave. Yeah, can't put anyone in here. I'm pretty sure this is where I put my scavalier yesterday. Or maybe it was the other one. I'm not really sure anymore. Hmm. Two berries. Okay, that's good. It's not bad, but it's good. And the last one, I think, is this one. The one that keeps avoiding us. Can't put anyone in here either. One berry this time. We're getting worse at this. Alright. Are we close enough for this one? Yeah, apparently we are. Oh no, uh... Hmm, yeah, I forgot. I did just did that. Seriously? No! This game sometimes, honestly. Okay. Are you gonna walk towards it now? No, this is just a waste of time. Okay, not, now it's a bit closer, apparently. Apparently it isn't. You know what? I don't have time for this. Let's just battle this Gyarados and get this over with. Because I want to go to sleep now. You can probably use Jolteon. Yep, Jol there's Jolteon. By the way, as you can see, I powered it up a bit. Took advantage of uh, some Stardust that I had and uh, some EV candy. And uh, powered up my Jolteon. I love my Jolteon. Never really, really been a big fan of Jolteon as a Pokemon, but in this game, this specific one, I like it. I like it a lot. Hi everyone, it's supposed to be here in this battle today. Hi Meeve. Boy, what's that guy's name? Okay, discharge. Wow, that, that did a lot of damage. But should I really be surprised though? I mean, it's a water flying type, so it's four times weak to electric. And it barely did, did any damage at all. Hi, Maviv. Okay, I, that's the guy's name. Don't wear it out. Hi everyone, it's a pleasure to be here in this battle today. 
Pretty sure this touch is gonna just gonna kill it. Well, maybe not kill it, but you know, you know what I meant. Wow, it really did kill it. Sort of. And I guess we're close enough to this one. Yes, we are. Now, no matter what I do, it's still gonna allow me to put one of these in here. So, let's put Magmortar in here. Just so I can feed it a lot. And hopefully, maybe, potentially gain some um, Magmar candy. For my new uh, Magby. As far as anyone else, like, well, like, I guess I gotta put Dragonite because... There aren't any other Pokemon in this gym, and uh, since I am planning to feed this one later today, I hopefully, hopefully I can get candies from that one, because I really need a lot of Dratini candies, because I have a really good Dratini that I want to evolve. So let's... Oops, didn't mean to click on that. So yeah, Magmortar, and apparently it didn't update about my... Uh, my Dragonite just yet, but so Magmortar and Dragonite are the only Pokemon that I have in gems right now. Not a very good look. Hopefully this can change by tonight, but I wouldn't hold my breath on that. As a matter of fact, by the time I'll uh, get to the night shift, my second night shift tonight, both of those Pokemon will probably be knocked out, so Again, not a very good look for me, but hopefully I can get around that. Anyways, I'm just gonna go back home. I'm not gonna do another recording tonight. First of all, I, just, I, I, I first thing I gotta do is I gotta upload the one that I did yesterday and upload this one uh, a few hours later, probably past midnight. So it'll at least look like. Uh, there was a, a day difference between the two. Maybe I'll upload the one that I did yesterday, right now. As soon as I get back home. Let's catch this Lunatone because it's bothering, bugging me. And uh, I'll upload this this one, the one I'm recording right now, when I'm at work. But again, past midnight. So it'll at least look like some time has passed. And it broke out. I really hope this Lunaton is uh, better than the other ones that I caught. Well, I guess we'll never know now, will we? Centrit. Centrit. <laughs> oh, the cat. So yeah, seems like a pretty good uh, plan for today. I'm gonna upload uh, the recording I did yesterday before going to sleep, and I'll go to work and upload this one uh, after I am a few hours into sleep. Oh, hold on. I got another hat with uh, uh, my loaded there. Guess it's not enough to gain to gain another heart, but not to worry. I'm gonna gain that third heart tonight at work because I'm gonna wait until um, 
past midnight. Now, this guy's driving like a, like a madman. I'm gonna wait until past midnight and, and I'm gonna feed, feed it some berries, play with it and take a snapshot. And those are three hearts already, so that'll be enough uh, to get it past the, uh, the third heart for the ultra buddies status. Clefairy! If it was, if it would have been a shiny, it would have been pretty fun way to end this video, but it isn't. And I realized that during this event, uh, Clefairy has a pretty high chance of being a shiny, but I mean, pretty high chance could be 5% as opposed to 3% the usual. You never know what high percent means in these things. Just because I'm here, let's just spin this one and uh, make a quick turn back home. So yeah, it's been a pretty productive uh, recording, if I do say so myself. And uh, problem is, I'm not really sure what title to give this video. But I guess I'll, uh, I'll think of something uh, later after it. Oh, look at that. I hatched an egg. So at least some, we, we now have something interesting to end this video on. Another Magby! This is awesome! Technically, I can evolve both Magbys, but I prefer to... Uh, Wait, at least until I have, I'll have enough uh, candy to evolve a, mag a Magmar. This one's not that good either, but still pretty good. Obviously, I'm going to put this one kilometer egg, which I can pretty much just hatch with just now, but like I said, I really, <laughs> I really need to go to the bathroom. And uh, I've been uh, recording this for about half an hour, so I guess I probably should end this recording now. Thank you guys for watching and see you guys later. Goodbye. Hello again everybody. I really hope you enjoyed this video because I really enjoyed making it. So if you like what you've seen here, please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe for more awesome content like this. So until next time guys, I'll see you guys next time.